<laughs> Hi, it's Tammy Nautillet behind the camera. Mr. Tillett has a team you order. He's going to open. Not sure which one he ordered a couple things. Might be both of them in there. We don't know. No, it won't be both. Okay. Probably hear the dogs panting behind me, beside me. Ah, uh, the driveway lights. Awesome. Yep. How many did you get? Bless you. Two, four, six, eight. Twelve. What? Oh, there's some in the middle? Oh, I didn't see those. Okay, yeah, there's twelve. They're upside down. Awesome. Alright, I'm gonna go. Cool. Hi beauties and bows, Tammy now till it back with a small tea move haul and beat up Friday. This is a foot mask with uh, it's avocado. There we go. We did my nails too. I love them. Those are came from Nikki at uh, hauling happy hauls, happy underscore hauls. That's it. <laughs> so many of us, it's hard to keep up with all of us. Hubby and I had doctor's appointment today just to follow ups for our meds, my blood pressure medicine, blah blah blah. And I am so ready get these boots off. Whoo boy that feels good. I love these boots. I got these boots from Timu as a matter of fact. About a year ago. I love them. They sure are shiny. And they're very comfortable even with that heel on them. I cannot walk in a spike heel. I would break every bone in my legs, back, and everything <laughs> if I tried to walk in a spike hill. I can't do it. Woo wee, I just can't do it. So let's see here. Let's open up this foot mask. How's everybody doing today? How many people were glad it's Friday? I mean, does it matter? You have to work anyway. I don't work outside of the home, but I am constantly working pretty much, well, I won't say 24-7, but quite a bit. So I'm constantly trying to think of new ideas for product videos and things like that to keep you all excited and wanting to come back. Oh, yeah. Woo! Pull this pant leg up. Oh yeah. They're always so wet and gooey. <laughs> First put them on. Oh, come on. I'm trying to get this tab off. It don't matter though. <sighs> get this sock off. So I am still asking to please make sure you are subscribed. Um, I have noticed that a lot of my favorite channels that I watch, when I go and watch their their videos, and I talk to them daily by texting. So, but I'll go to watch their email, or their emails, their videos, and I got to right now, I just check, automatically I check, because I'm unsubscribed, I don't know how many times. Okay, why well, won't this open? Come on, I need my foot in there. So... I've had to resubscribe. I don't know how many times, like I said, and it's, I don't know what's going on. I mean, I'm sure YouTube's not sitting there going, well, let's, let's go and scrub this person and that person from this channel just to 
be aggravating. There's got to be a glitch in the system somewhere. I just don't know what it is. But uh, get this drink open. Hydrate, as Aaron says. Hey, everybody. Of course, water probably would be better. But I'll go with my Mountain Dew Zero. Kay should be coming in here pretty soon, too. Get some of this gooey stuff. I'm going to put my feet up here in just a minute. I'm going to actually do my feet up Friday. If you've been with me for a while, you know that I always, at the end of my videos, will say, Be beautiful. And I had a sign right up here that was a neon sign. And it said, be beautiful. It was, um, pretty sure B was pink, U was white, and Tiffle was pink. And then when you turn it on, lit it up, you know, it, it stayed that. Um, so, to make a long story short, I came out here one day to do a video, and I discovered that the wire had been pulled out of the back of it. And uh, my son was out here moving some furniture. When he did, it pulled the wire out, so that's what happened to that. My husband tried to fix it, because usually he could fix things like that, but it was pulled directly straight out of the back, and so there was no fixing to it. So I reordered one. This is the box that came in. There's a neon sign in here. Look at this box. Look at this box. You heard that car horn. That's my niece, Kay. Look at that. Isn't that crazy? Yeah. Um, I did contact Timu about it to let them know. I said, uh, so look. I'm not contacting you because I want to get a refund or send it back because I want it for my videos. I just wanted you to know how items are being sent out and I'm not the only creator who's receiving things. I'll take a milkshake if you have money. Oh yeah. No, no whipped cream. Thanks. <laughs> I always take a milkshake. Um, all us creators have been having problems receiving items and they're, they're chipped or broken or items missing. So and I'm not saying it's Timu as a whole, as a company's fault. Because there are different sellers who sell, just like with Amazon and, and Walmart too, online, there are different sellers who you buy from on there. So I just wanted to let her know that. and. Uh, so, she did report that, let them know, and we, we came to an agreement together. Alright, I'm not going to rip this box apart, but this is how it came. This was tied up. They did take it out, plug it in, make sure it worked before I called teammates. These are the cups that come with it. It did not come with the chain. Nope, there's no chain. There's no chain in the box. There's nothing in this box at all. In this big box for this little light. Nothing was wrapped around it other than this plastic that's right here. And that's it. How it made it through all of this and was not broke is a miracle. It's beyond me of, of how it did, but it did. So, but anyway, there's that box. Get this off.
difficulties. Hoodies don't come off. I wanted to see if I have something close to me to show you. But anyway, it's all white. And I was like, well, you know, I really, I took the other one that the wire was ripped out of and put it inside the house over my desk and just put screws in the wall. I didn't, my husband did it for me. So but what I'm seeing right here is these wires aren't looking very good here in the back. I don't know. Let's see if I can get this close so you can see that. See what I'm talking about? Hopefully, it'll be okay. I'll be out of frame for just a second, sorry. Hoping you're going to be able to see this. Heck yeah. It's going to be bright at first. Green light off for a minute. Okay. There we go. So. This is pink, this is white, and this is pink. So I'm I'm happy with that. So bring light back on. Get this unplugged. And then I will get my husband. Well I had the chain from the last one. Let me put it up a little bit. A little bit higher. What's the time on this? In front of this video, I'm going to, excuse me, include a little short clip of where Johnny, Mr. Tillett, uh, was opening up his tea new order. So, yeah, I'm going to sit here and enjoy my feet being up. Oh, I'm telling you what, it's been a day. <laughs> it's been a day. Man, that's the weekend. And I still gotta get this video uploaded, which I love this. I love doing this. This makes me so happy. You have no idea. To make the videos, think about what they're gonna be, ordering them, um, taking my credit that I get from teammate to do with that, or my own money. I'm not sponsored from Timu, but I do get paid for the videos that I submit uh, to them, and believe me, it's not much, but to me, any income, extra income, is extra income, right? As long as money's coming in, money's coming in, so um, I have now every single person on our Christmas list so as soon as I get a few more items in um, including the Christmas bag that I ordered to put them in then I will start bagging them up and I have totes and big bags that I've ordered from and I mean big bag like big storage bag that zip up with the windows on them um, that I'm going to put them in that way they can't get dusty or you know Especially since they're out here in the cottage, because yes, it's a it's our cottage, but it's a shed. It's beautiful, but the way we've got it redone I means it's with the double doors and the two windows and redone in here. But I mean, and it's very well insulated except for around the doors, and up here in the attic, there's attic on each side. But from this attic, there is a uh, it's screened in, but there's a vent. So, still little bugs get in here and there, spiders and all that, and dust. So, once I get them in the bag, and I get them, I'm going to seal them up in something so they can't get little roly-poly or spiders or bugs or whatever from outside. 
in them and keep them clean. And so, yep, by the 1st of September, I should have all that done and put away and ready. So, you know, I, I get some flack back on that, and that's fine. I got big shoulders. I can take it. I don't, I don't understand anybody who waits until the last minute to go buy Christmas and then say, well, I just, I just didn't have that much money to, to, to buy anything. You got a whole year. So, it is what it is. You know, I'm, I'm with shopping through Timu, mostly. Um, get great items. The blankets that I got everybody this year are so soft so cuddly and personalized either with their names or personalized with their their favorite team so everybody's gonna be happy with that some are lap like blankets maybe and the other ones are big size blankets so there's just different ones for different ones and I think everybody's gonna be pleased with that kind of if somebody gets me a blanket with my name on it. A big old cuddle up blanket. So they do they do they don't they don't. I am gonna have to have one when we get to Florida to go on the boat with probably or wrap up really well. I don't know how I lived in Florida in, in the winter time years ago, back in twenty oh wow, it must have been twenty eleven. Yep, I lived in Florida for the winter time, and it was cold. We had a freeze. They had to spray the strawberries so that they wouldn't freeze. It was a big ordeal. It snow for Christmas. It was crazy. I'm like, you're welcome. I brought that down to you from Ohio. <laughs> That's where I moved from. But I'm back in Kentucky, my home state, where I was born and raised. I love it here. It's beautiful. Um, we've had more reports of bears here and there. Um, we've seen a bear or two here when we first moved in. and That's been a few years ago. And every now and then, but it's been a couple years, we thought we heard one, but we haven't actually seen one for a while here. And you would think being in such a rural area that we would, that we haven't seen one for a while. Um, we do have the coyotes, we have the fox, we have the raccoons, we have the possums, you name it, getting after our chickens. In bright daylight, I mean, how much brass can you have to get an animal in bright daylight? Which is why we keep a very close eye on our little stinker, because she weighs 18 pounds soaking wet. And speaking of soaking wet, she loves to go down to that pond, which is a good two acres away from the house. So there would be nothing in the world that I could do to save her if she was down at that pond and that coyote decided to grab her run off. Nothing. There's nothing I could do. So when uh, she's out, I always try to make sure that Grizzly is out with her. But Grizzly doesn't. He'll go down and get his feet wet, maybe wet up to his stomach, but... He usually don't go down that pond unless we're down there too. Otherwise, he stays. And he'll go out, venture out a little bit on the property, but not actually to the pond unless we're down there. She don't care if we're there or not. She'll go down that pond and she swims. And she comes back to soak wet. She doesn't blow a rat. Drown the rat. But so adorable. She's got that blue eye and that brown eye. And she just looks at you so sweet. She's just beautiful. <laughs> With a little bit of evil. <laughs> gotta love it. <laughs> you gotta love it. Because they're all women. <laughs> so tell me in the comments, are you a little bit evil too, or are you all 100% angels? And I see everybody else blinking their big old eyes like, I am. Hmm. I know I have some sisters out there. I have one in particular that's a twin. Yeah. They're out there. Oh, man. It's nice sitting here, though. All just peaceful and quiet down here in this cottage. I'm going to be doing some rearranging. 
and uh, dang on, I forgot to pick up magnets today. My uh, Marisi Buku sign, I put magnets on the back of it, and they're not strong enough, the ones I had. Because the two double doors we have that go out of the cottage are metal. Um, but the metal, the magnets on the back of that wasn't heavy enough. And I'm not drilling holes into the door, and we're not drilling any more holes than what we have. That That's the rivets that's put in where they put the seams inside to cover up the insulation on here. So we try to use those as much as we can to hang up things we hang up. If we can't use those, then I'll use double-sided tape. So I just hate putting extra holes into it. Now once we decide to do shelves or something, I might, but we'll see. Um, up here on, you can't see it, but I'm sure you've seen like the sheds before that have um, the so-called attics up over them. And all of this is wrapped in this metal, even the, the attic up top. And it's got a lip on it that's covered in the, the metal too. It's powder coated, but it's, I don't know what they done or if powder coat means that it doesn't leave any residue. But yeah, so, but it gets a scratch. Now, if you can see that or not, but there's a scratch right here. I'm not sure how it got there. But like I said, this has been used for a shed for years until we decided to do this. Um, but we did have bunk beds out here. So maybe the bunk beds did that. But they're still out here down the other side now. But anyway, um, I'm not, I haven't decided exactly how I'm going to do it. I know we're putting the, the bar that my husband's making out of the um, pallets. I can't wait to show you that. Putting that over here. So I, from Timu, I ordered the, uh, the wine glass holders that slide in, like they go into your cabinets. And then under your cabinets, the wine glass hangs down. So I'm going to use those on the lip up here over the uh, where the bar is going in so I'm excited you know Rome was the building built in a day and this cottage is not going to be either and this is just a place just to kind of come and hang out and uh, get out of the house for a while we have an air conditioner out here it doesn't take much to so well insulated and it's about paid off <laughs> so, once it's paid off, and then Mr. Tillett gets his own little shed to put all of his little tools and, and lawnmowers and things in. And so, some of the stuff that's over here in this corner will be going over into that shed. Then we can get the bar built there. So, let's see. How long have I been yakking my mouth? Let me see. Uh... Did I say an hour? No. 21 minutes. 22 minutes. Okay. It scared me for a minute. Okay, so 22 minutes of me yakking my mouth. I'm going to go ahead and be taking off. Whee! The foot mask. Boy, did my feet need this. And I'm actually going to turn this inside out, put my hand in here, rub this in real good. Thank you so much. Um, once again, I am still having, of course, the giveaway. I have a long way to go to get my hours built up. I'm not even at a thousand yet, and I don't know why or how. It doesn't make sense. I heard someone last night that said they had started their channel in February and already was monetized with the which the with the watch time hours. I'm like, how? Because I had this channel for a while. I was doing Avon videos on here uh, before I quit doing that and started doing the team hauls and everything. So um, I don't know. But um, the ways you can help with that is going to my playlist and click on the playlist that you want to hear and then you know, it'll be uh, on your TV if, you, if you're watching it on TV like on Roku or um, the Fire Stick it says play all I think it might say the same thing on the phone I'm not exactly sure I don't I think it's a little different 
but uh, but anyway, it, it's pretty much self-explanatory. It'll play the whole playlist. Even if you turn it on, turn the volume down, lay your phone down, or just let it play in the background, you can still be on Facebook, TikTok, whatever you want to be on, and still have that in the background. I truly appreciate it. Let it play overnight while you're sleeping, <laughs> volume turned down, while you charge your phone. I would appreciate it. Um, but, so once I get to 2,000 subscribers and the 4,000 watch time hours and I'm, I'm going to post tomorrow morning when I run my report on my, on my analytics on how many watch time hours I have. I'll post it tomorrow morning ish and then um, probably again Monday or Tuesday probably I think that's what I'm going to do is probably Tuesdays and Saturday mornings post a picture like a screenshot of how many watch hours I have and uh, how many subscribers and let's get that built up and then as soon as we get there then we're gonna have we're gonna draw there's gonna be four ten dollar visa cards and this is internationally and uh, what I would do internationally is email you a front and back picture of the card so that you'll have that and if you're National, and then I will mail you the card. Um, I am. I can't be responsible for any of them not making it. I'm so sorry, but that's we have to say that too. And also, um, I'll post all the rules down below as well for that. So, oh boy, my feet feel so good with this on. I thank you for those of you who are uh, doing that already, playing my playlist watching my videos and sharing them and liking them. Make sure you like them um, when you can because that also shows the YouTube algorithm algorithm to uh, send my videos out for, to recommend them to other people. So I think that is all I have to say. Again, thank you. I love you and be you to full. It'll be lit up next time for you. Bye.